What about the breadth, Bruce? These are stocks above their 50-day moving average, and it's a type of a breadth indicator. Note how the momentum will start to wane, so that affects probabilities of success. And right now, you can see that stocks above their the 100, the NASDAQ 100 is making a series of lower highs, which we can get into more uh, at a later time. But then the NASDAQ comp, which is all stocks in the, in the NASDAQ, you can see that's even more well-defined as being in a uh, deteriorating uh, uptrending condition. And uh, that doesn't mean that the uptrend can't continue but it does mean that it continues to narrow and narrow and narrow. I just narrow. want to that today's promotion, for those of you who's going to join us, and I know a lot of you will after today's session, instead of $99, uh, we're giving you $79 per month.